Let's put it to the test. Fresh herbs, basil leaves, line them up for a simple chiffonade. Once again. Perfect. If your chef asks you for fresh herbs, chopped, this is what he's looking for. Chiffonade of basil. Wow. Thanks for watching. Testing out this awesome Japanese Damascus knife. When I'm all done, I wipe it off. Goes back in the knife guard. Just like that. Wow. Just finishing up a real quick recipe, I thought I'd share it with you here. I've got about four ounces of cannellini beans here. I've got some Vidalia onion. I've got uh, some canned corn in here as well. Okay. Uh, some sliced grape tomatoes, some artichokes, some oregano and some basil, some extra virgin olive oil, a splash of balsamic vinegar, as well as uh, fresh ground black pepper, Hawaiian sea salt, and I'm gonna top this off with some fresh diced avocado. Oh yeah, this is an appetizer and it's best served chilled and most importantly, uh, I'll show you what's, what's going on here. This is a really popular appetizer in certain parts of the country. Oh yeah, it's going to be good. Toasted corn tortilla quick tasting here. Personally, a little extra herbs. How does that look? Drop a comment. Wow! get cooking. Have a great day. Oh yeah. Sweet knife. Paired with the best butcher block. This is what you need here. 
check out your sponsor. Oh yeah, it's going to be good. Well, you get the idea. Very nice cuts. Very consistent. This knife is amazing. Yeah. Perfect and easily. Carved orange cup. And uh, move on to the next cooking project. In case you're wondering what I got going on here, this is uh, grapes, watermelon, oranges, and Madagascar vanilla bean, uh, all stuffed into the orange cup. Basically made all of this from uh, just the orange there. Put a little bit of this uh, vanilla juices on there here. Wow, what do you think of that? So watch the other videos kick your cooking up to a whole new level yeah and get yourself some of these Japanese knives wow I really really like this knife get cooking and have a great day Oh yeah, a big shout out to Valley, one of my friends who processed and then dried these fresh strawberries, which are just amazing. Really, really nice, super sweet, and uh, they can be stored for a long, long time once you dry them out like that. Wow. Oh yeah, I got this fresh fruit cup. I decided to put a few of these dried strawberries in my little chopper here and garnish the fruit cup with some flakes of strawberries. Like, share, subscribe. Watch the chef's other videos. In my kitchens, I have several. This one here is going on, oh, I think, I think this end grain rock maple is over 20 years old now. It's been cut on a million times. The knife does not hurt it. It's the hardest surface you want for your knife. Contact like this. Cutting, chopping, slicing, dicing will not hurt the knife blade, will not hurt the block. Check your sponsor there. They're having a free shipping sale. <laughs> Select Hard Rock Maple is the chef's choice. Choose from several sizes with a juice groove without the juice groove, reversible, charcuterie board, solid walnut, 
solid cherry, even walnut rustic grain, reversible, round, square, rectangle, free shipping. Oh, it's going to be good. Wow, the Jambus Cucina Elegante, handcrafted with the finest American hardwoods, food service grade stainless steel. The Elegante features inch and a half thick butcher block, available in several sizes and with several options. Call your sponsor and save money. Ask for a discount. Oh yeah, it's going to be good. Boost blocks, buy the best the first time, save money. So the mystery oil is applied in a circular motion. You're going to like it. Oh yeah, it's going to be good.
oh so nice to cut on contact the sponsor they're having a sale and I know there's free shipping as well yeah that that is the good stuff right there Professional cutting board, chopping block, butcher block, custom sizes, 